Hello there, folks, and welcome back to Pure Wyoming Productions. And today on Amazon Live, I have a whole bunch of great products. Some are going to be for the women in your house, some for the men in your house, and then also some sports-related uh, products like ice fishing gear. So I'm so glad to have you here today. Go ahead and hit that follow button as it will help us be able to continue to make great content for you in the future. Remember to put some uh, comments in the comment section or chat section so that we can go ahead and better serve you by answering your detailed questions. All right. So anyways, having a fantastic morning right here. Right here we have the Acrismo or Acrismi. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but the name of this brand is A-K-I-R-A-C-O-S-M-E. E. This was sent to us for you, full disclosure there. Comes in this very nice, high quality cardboard box. As you can see, opens up nicely, kind of like a shoe box. Um, I did remove some of the packaging and we did test this out already. Um, so that's why there's not as much packaging in the box. Comes with this very nice, soft microfiber storage bag for this uh, air, hair straightener. Now, as you can see, it's a very nice hair straightener. It's got a polymer outer body, has your locking switch right here on the tang of it where the cord goes in. To unlock it, you simply push back and that's gonna allow it to open up a lot uh, greater degree, push it forward to lock it closed. Um, this is polymer, it has some knurling on it, so it's not too hard to grab, but it is a little bit stiff. Um, down in the inside here, you have your two heating coils right here, or irons, I should say. Um, and then what's interesting is that your LCD screen or your function settings are controlled right here. So we're going to go ahead and plug this in real quickly and show you. It says off right there. You're going to hit the power button. And you can set the temperature in Celsius all the way up to 230 or all the way down to 150. Um, so we're going to set that up to 200 and leave it on for just a second. I'm just going to touch this. I do not recommend you touching it follow the safety protocols, precautions, and guidelines. I just want to do this so I can show you. It's already hot, just that quick. So it heats up super, super quick. Simply push the off button. It's going to let you know it's off right there. So excellent, really quickly heating hair straightener. Go ahead and check them out. All right, folks. Looks like we have a viewer. Nice to see you there. Go ahead and give us a follow so we can keep bringing you some great content here. Oops. Working in a pretty small studio today. It's about six feet by seven feet, basically the size of a closet. Anyways, now we on to some uh, ice fishing gear, you know. Uh, so, you know, it's pretty cold up here in the northern states and it's about 10 degrees where I'm living today. Um, but anyways, we have here is Beyond Ice braided ice fishing line. It comes in blizzard uh, blue color, which is kind of almost like a baby blue color. Um, and this happens to be eight pound uh, test, but you can get it in different weightages. This is a hundred yards. And um, what's nice is this is an eight strand braided line. So it's going to be really abrasion resistant, durable. And the biggest thing is it's not going to stretch. It doesn't have memory meaning like monofilament line, when you stretch it out, it stays stretched out or it wants to boing back and coil. That's like line memory. This doesn't have that problem, so it's not going to tangle as easily. Um, also, because it doesn't stretch, it's going to help you hook into that fish. Um, and then on top of that, um, because it's uh, got coatings on it. And because the material that's used, it's not going to absorb water and want to freeze and get really hard on you like some other braided line out there or monofilament or floral carbon line. So excellent uh, ice fishing line. If you're looking for a braided ice fishing line, works really good for those, you know, smaller pike, musky, and walleye out there. And it's quite affordable. Um, and it's the company's based in the United States. All right, let's put that off to the side here. 
And on to the next product. Oh, what do we have here? Okay. Right here we have some Sco Tank or Scott Tank. Hmm. How do you pronounce that? Not sure. Stainless steel wire leader. Now these are 50 pound wire leaders. So you can use these for those huge musky, pike, salmon, uh, you name it, even some saltwater species out there. This is going to be plenty of strong enough leader for those musky ice fishermen out there or, you know, summertime fishing. And uh, these are these come in three different sizes. So uh, you got uh, three different sizes and then you got 20 of each in here. Comes with stainless steel snaps and the steel braid has a coating on it. So it's going to be rust and corrosion resistant. I do believe they are made in China. Let's go ahead and double check there. Yes, made in China. Now I did buy these. I didn't get them for free or anything like that. Um, I've used their brand once before. It seems to worked all right for me. They do come clipped on here. I'm gonna unclip one real quick so I can show you. Doo, 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 doo. Hope you guys are having a fantastic morning. Sometimes they are a little tough to get out of the packaging. All right. All right. So now that I got that one out, let's go ahead and show you right here. We have a very nice, as you can see, it's pretty hard to see. I mean, that's got pretty low visibility, um, has really nice braid work. Like I said, a thick, like almost, I think that's like a plastic uh, coating, really thick coating on it. So it's going to be uh, uh, abrasion and rust resistant. And then it has some really like fine, um, stitching a wolving right here to hold the loops in quite strong. And then you have your nice stainless steel clip right here, another clip, or excuse me, a swivel on this side. So this side is your clip. This side is your swivel right here. Nice, high quality, affordable leader. All right. Put those off to the side again, and then on to the next product. Okay. Now, here, folks, we have a Laco Double Trouble Pike Tip Up Leader. So if you're ice fishing for pike, muskie, um, this is a great leader to go with. I did buy this. Let's go ahead, pull it out. And this leader comes with a nice steel core leader that has a coating on it. So it's rust, rust and corrosion resistant, excuse me. Nice big red bead up on top here. Nice big size swivel. Um, and then it has your two uh, painted red hooks, a single hook right here with a nice gnarly big old um, barb on it and then your treble hook. And the way this works is, is these are great for tip ups because what usually happens with ice fishing tip ups is that your fish get off, right? Especially pike, um, they don't get hooked. They take the, the bait fish and they get away. Well, this one, you can hook this say over the top and then in the mouth right here. And that way you have double the chances basically of making sure you stay hooked into that pike or muskie. Make sure, of course, you follow your local, state, and federal guidelines, as sometimes there is hook limits or barb uh, restrictions in certain lakes or areas. All right. Put that over there. Okay, now another great product for the, the people who like to shoot out there uh, or hunt, but uh, right here, Right here, we have the Sonic King weapons mounted light. Now this light features an all uh, aircraft grade aluminum body that has a hard anodized finish. It screws onto a standard width Picatinny rail via this little thumb or flathead adjustable screw. Note that that is flathead. I would like to see that be Torx head instead. That is something to note there. Has your left right adjustment right here and your left right adjustment right here for both your lasers so it has two different lasers and a bright LED light built into it. The top left button is going to put that red laser on right there. Top right button is going to put the green laser on. You can use them both at the same time. You can turn them both on and off at the same time as well. Simple push rubberized push buttons right here. Bottom light is going to give you that nice bright strobe and then vice versa, both sides. If you hold both on at the same time, it's going to be a nice solid bright, really ultra bright LED light. So really excellent uh, little dual laser light right here. Great for a pistol or maybe on the on an AR, depending on your setup. But anyways, good little light comes with an internal lithium ion battery and a USB-C 
or excuse me, a USB micro cord to charge this. Um, in our initial testing, the battery did last a couple of hours with the lasers and about mm, 30 minutes to an hour with the light. All right, on to the next product here. Let's go ahead and take a look. Here we have the OTW RS25, one by 22 by 33 millimeter reflex sight. Uses a CR2032 battery, um, has 11 brightness settings, four different reticles, fits a 20 millimeter standard with Picatinny rail, multi-coated lenses and aviation grade aluminum. Um, this was sent to us for review, full disclosure there. I have had a couple other products and so far I'd have to say they're suitable, you know, maybe on your airsoft gun at 22 uh, light duty use. Um, here we have this nice hard anodized finish over this aircraft grade aluminum. You have your illumination set settings right here. It's at zero is off or O is off and has one through 11 settings. You simply adjust that. It has a detent that's pretty easy. The reticle's easy to see. Um, there's a little washout in it, but not too bad. Then you simply remove this cap right here. And that's going to have your battery that does come included. It has a nice big rubber O-ring on it, so it is water resistant at the very least. Let's go ahead and screw that in there. A little bit tough sometimes to get the threads lined up, but not too bad. On the back here, you have a selector switch for your reticle style. It has a single dot, uh, crosshairs, uh, a circle with a dot in the middle. So very easy to select, works quite nicely. A little bit rough, but it does get the job done. Has two Allen keys, uh, screws to tighten this onto the Picatinny rail, which is quite beefy actually. And then um, you have, of course, your uh, elevation and windage adjustment screws, one on the side and one on the top. The site seems to work all right. We haven't done a ton of testing with it, um, but so far, so good. Let's go ahead and put that bad boy away there. Put that off to the side, folks. Yeah, and we're, oh, oh, there's, okay, I didn't have it selected or highlighted yet, but uh, hopefully you can see that in the carousel below, we had the OTW25. And now coming on to um, another item. These I bought for my daughter because we like to ski, uh, snowboard, um, snowmobile and all that good stuff. And so here we have the Merowol, M-E-R-I, M-E-R-I, W-O-O-L, wool socks. Now, we opted for these nice pink, pink ones. They have a high wool content, which means they're going to basically retain their thermal properties better even when wet, which is a benefit of wool. They're going to keep your feet warmer and they're just going to be better. Basically, those higher wool content socks, especially if it's high quality premium wool, especially merino wool, are going to do a better job. As you can see here, it has really nice looped um, like twill interior right here. Nice elastic, so it's going to fit onto that uh, ankle very well. Has good stitching around the seams on both the um, heel area and the toe area. Has some elastic built into the middle here, so that's going to stretch and keep tight on the center of your foot. Um, really nice, comfortable socks. My daughter loves them. We got her a bunch of pairs of them, and so far they've been keeping her feet happy, healthier, and warmer. All right, let's go off to the side here. All right, folks, so here we have the Hangred 6-in-1 men's pen, or I shouldn't say men, anybody can use this. Um, but this was something that we got for review, full disclosure there. It comes in this nice hard case right here, made of plastic. It comes with three very nice ink cartridges that seem to be high quality and ha are made of actual metal. Pulling out the pen right here, you have this very nice um, orange pen that has different types of measurement units, has millimeters and centimeters right there on the side, as well as inches, as you can see. It has a nice high quality metal clip. And then built in right here, we have a little bubble level. So you can use this to level something. It is flat on the side, so you could actually use this to level. 
has a little um, like silicone pad right here. So you can use this to write on a touch screen. You pull that off. And what's really cool about this, you un unscrew that and it's got a flathead screwdriver right here. You pull that out and switch around. It's got a Phillips head. So really, really nifty right there. A uh, great thing to have in your desk drawer or in your car. Um, just in case something needs a little repair or quick measurement. On this end, you simply turn this and then your very nice high quality pen tip comes out. So excellent gift idea right there. Really do enjoy it. Let's put that off to the side, folks. I'm gonna put that in my desk drawer. And I like that it comes with those extra ink cartridges. All right, now we got something over here. Here is a divorce pack clear plastic bag or handbag you could use this for toiletry items or makeup has a pleather like or leather like upper zipper with a metal little clasp on it your carrying strap that appears to be made out of a leather like material an actual metal clasp right here you can remove this from the side right here has a little clasp, you can remove it if you don't want it and you can just use this little wrist strap. Now this is nice and clear. So if you're going to an airport or somewhere where there's high security and they wanna be able to see inside your bag, this is a great bag to use. It was sent to us for review, full disclosure there, but go ahead and check them out. All right, what do we have here? All righty. Here we have a divorce pack, that's V-O-R-S-P-A-C-K, men's toiletry bag. This one's made out of like a nylon or a nylon material, it's all synthetic. Has a little carrying strap right here built inside. Has a front pouch, nice zipper, opens up nicely right there. Zipper seems pretty easy to use, nice and smooth. Then it has your main pouch right here that is zipper closed. Has a whole bunch, three mess, mesh pouches on this side. And on the other side, it has one bigger mess, mesh, ugh, I could, can't say mesh today, pouch um, that utilizes a zipper to open and close it. So you have an area, let's say for um, your razor cartridges and your toothpaste and toothbrushes and so on. So this was sent to us for review, full disclosure, but it's a decent little bag. So go ahead and check it out. All righty, where did I put, okay, here we go. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day there. Remember to hit that follow button. It'll help us be able to bring you guys more great content. We're up here in the Northern United States and I gotta tell you, it was uh, two degrees this morning. So nice cold day, but anyways, here we have this nice high quality jump rope that we did purchase. Um, it has a steel cord running through the center of it with a nice, very thick, ample thick coating or covering sheath, I guess you could say, to protect not only the cord from being corroded or abrased, but it also keeps it from, you know, if you accidentally hit yourself, it's not going to cut you with that steel center cord in there. And being that it does have a steel center cord, this thing's practically indestructible. You don't have to worry about this thing breaking. Nice long loop on it. And then it has swivels or ball bearing in here, I believe. And this swivel is so smooth. You don't have to worry about this catching in the handle and torquing up or twisting up on you. And then on the handle itself, it is very lightweight, made of plastic uh, um, uh, at the center. And then it has these nice rubber, uh, very soft rubber padding around it. So it's super comfortable in the hands, easy to grip even when you're sweaty. Uh, good little jump right rope there. So go ahead and check those out. Let's go ahead and put that away. And on to the next product. Okay, here we go. A TENS unit. I got a TENS unit for you guys. If you don't know what a TENS EMS unit is, basically it's a, uh, a neural mu muscle uh, massager. Um, I'm not a medical professional, so follow the safety protocols, precautions, and guidelines of the device. Here we have an AVCO, A-V-C-O-O. EMS TENS unit. This is a 24 mode TENS unit. Was sent to us for review, full disclosure. Features an all polymer outer body, has your two attachments, both for A and B. So you can attach your electrodes right here. 
comes with a whole bunch of adhesive pads. On the bottom here is a USB-C cord plug-in, and it does come with USB-C cord. So you plug this in, and you can select your modes, your plus or minus intensity, and your TENS unit settings by operating this center control module. We've had several of these. They all work really good. They, in our experience, have relieved some of our pain, though I cannot speak for you. So go ahead and check those out. Go ahead and put that away there. Um, we have, I don't know, 20 TENS units, and we love them. When I have neck pain, uh, joint pain, I use them. Stiff muscle, it really it sends electrical impulses through basically the subcutaneous layer of your flesh and therefore triggers those nerves and sends impulses through them that basically short circuit or relieve that pain. Um, at least that's been my experience with them. All right, so here we have do, do, do. right here is our club room quarter zip sweater for men. Um, this is an extra large. I'm about 210 pounds and five foot, uh, nine and a half to five foot ten. It fits me nicely. I will say this, it has a lot of cotton in it, so it's very comfortable, but if you do plan on putting this in the dryer, I would go one size larger than you normally do. So if you're an extra large, get a 2X. If you're a large, get an extra large. That way when it shrinks a little bit over time, it's not gonna pull up on your belly or the sleeves aren't gonna get too short. This one has some nice design in it um, in the woven stitching. Um, the zipper has a little like leather-like tassel or tab. The zipper on it, oh, looks like it got snagged. So it's not unsnagable zipper. Let's see here. Okay, up and down. Yeah, it works all right. I haven't had any problems with it until I go to show it to you guys, of course, but it seems to be snagging right there. Of course, I think when you're actually wearing it, it's a little easier. It wants to snag right along that collar seam right there. The fabric kind of comes in towards the zipper. So that is something to note, folks. It does have this collar built into it right here, but nice little comfortable zipper. It's not too thick. It's actually pretty breathable and thin. So it's not one you're gonna wanna wear in really cold weather unless you have a jacket over it, but does look very nice and sits nicely on the skin. Let's put that off to the side there. And doo -doo 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 -doo. this is one of my favorite things. Um, I love having this around. All right, folks, so here we have the Trav Log. T-R-A-V-L-O-G, portable lithium-ion powered air compressor. Now, this thing is a lifesaver. It was sent to us for review. I've had a couple of these. I love them. I love them. I love them. Keep one in each vehicle. Keep one in your garage. Keep one in your shed. This is an absolute lifesaver. Um, it has an internal lithium-ion battery, and it comes with a, uh, a cord to charge it. It also has an, a full-size USB-A output, so you can use this to charge your phone in an emergency, charge an electronic device comes with this removable little uh, tube right here that has fabric coating over it to protect it and your valve, of course. It comes with some needle valves and a couple different assorted valves that fit in here so you can fill your basketballs, your bike tires, and you can use this on a truck tire, ATV tire, which is what I end up using it for. This thing is absolutely fantastic. So you simply push down this middle button to turn it on. And then you can select you, the U button right here on the right from you can select bar, KPA, KG, or PSI. Let's put on PSI, M over here on the left. You can select for vehicle, motorcycle, bicycle, or basketball. Let's go vehicle. You select up or down on the plus or minus tab, set your desired PSI or pressure, and it automatically turns off when it reaches that pressure, which is so nice because you don't have to worry about overinflating it. Push that button, it turns right on. absolutely love this thing. It, it is, like I said, a lifesaver. If your tire starts going flat on your bicycle, your ATV, you name it, keep one of these rounds. Great in case of emergencies. It does take a long time to fill a basketball or not a basketball, a truck tire, um, but it does work. It just takes a bit longer, but excellent portable little air compressor right here. All right, here we have a Neutrogena 
All right, folks. So here we have Neutrogena Hydro Boost High Pressed Night, excuse me, Night Pressed Serum. This is has hyaluronic acid in it, which is great for your skin. Comes in this nice high quality container. Smells pretty good. Smells kind of like baby powder a little bit, like original regular baby powder. Very soft, creamy, very oily feeling in the fingers, but great for your skin. It's going to keep your face looking fresh and clean and acne free. At least that's been my wife's experience. All right, now let's go on to the next product right here. We have these Nortiv 8 hiking boots. Now they have these in like mid calf or low, and these are the, the mid ones. Um, these are fully waterproof, breathable, and windproof. They come with an extra set of laces, which is super nice. They were sent to us for review, full disclosure there. Has a nice beefy sole on it, hard rubber, but it has like this almost like soft texturing or fabric texturing on it so that it's not going to scuff up squeak on hardwood floors. It's not going to scuff that hardwood floor or make it squeak. Um, has a like hard rubber coating right here on the toe to protect the toe from abrasion. Has synthetic, almost like a ripstop material here on top all the way around. Has a little loop right here so you can pull up on the heel and get it on your foot. The foam inside feels kind of like a memory foam. And we wore them just for, you know, I don't know, 15 minutes around so far. Seemed comfortable, seemed to fit true to sizing, and they are extremely lightweight. So go ahead and check those out. All right, folks, it looks like that's it for our Amazon live stream for this morning. We'll probably have another one up later on today. So make sure and stay tuned and give us a follow.